सो गुड मॉर्निंग क्लास ट्वेल्थ टूडे आई शेल बी डिस्कसिंग येस्टरडेज असाइनमेंट एंड देन वी शेल बी मूविंग टू द टूडेज चैप्टर दैट इज अ क्विक रिविजन टूडे वी हैव टू गो थ्रू द चैप्टर देन टू टेक्शुअल क्वेश्चन लेंथी क्वेश्चन आई शेल बी गिविंग यू टू फॉर द होमवर्क सो फर्स्ट असाइनमेंट दैट आई गिव येस्टरडे फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज लीड स्टोरी विच मीन्स अ मेन स्टोरी then a figured which means a calculated fear is a cost of convince steering is looking intentively and get very far that means an escape fussing with is going through then a lemonoid which means lemon drink and worth is value next is the question that i gave yesterday was does charlie agree that stamp collected hab collect thing habit is a way of escapism why see escapism means to run away from the reality so what charles see his friend he has described he has told to um the psychiatrist friend has told to charlie that the hobby that he has that is to escape from the reality but what was the belief of a charles charlie he says no charlie doesn't agree with his friend sam that is psychiatrist charlie's grandfather collected a stamp collected a stamp but he never uh, he never realized uh, he never run away from the reality even president roswit american president who won world war 2 loved collecting stamps so these two uh, these two example in charlie's life is father's example grandfather's example and president example that describes that tells him both were uh, both the people they they were uh, that is strict to their duties also and they collected the stamp roswit who was a president of uh, president of america he being a president collected a stamp that was his hobby but still he in his workouts that is he won the world war so that shows that he uh, charlie believed that collecting stamp is not running away from the reality second was why was charlie not able to get gales work the reason this question uh, the other way i had given that yesterday also but uh, Uh, let us discuss once again uh, charlie was not able to get to galesburg because the amount that he had that is um, um he uh, he didn't have that amount when first time he he was in third level and when he returned back he collected the old amount he reached to the uh, grand railway station but what happened he could uh, move up to level 1 level 2 at the station he searched for third level but alas the door had vanished and he could not reach there so he searched and searched and searched but could not be there so this is what the answers are for uh, your yesterday's assignment so class now let us have a quick revision of this chapter the third level class 12th so first if we make a flow chart first is charles uh, charles is reaching a third level so here the important points that comes in this is charles in a hurry to reach home reaches grand central to catch a subway loses his way enters a corridor which turns left and begins to slant down words reaches the third level of grand central station now second is seen from the past now after he reaches the grand uh, central station level 4 uh, sorry level 3 what he sees over there small town fewer ticket windows information booth made of wood lights dit uh, lights dit and flickering um then uh, sorry lights dim and flickering uh, brass spittoons on the floor for splitting people having pocket watches side burns and fancy mustache wearing old fashion clothes locomotives um then having a funnel shaped stacks charle realizes he has entered the past glances at the newspaper the world's newspaper out of publication and headlines about uh president clevcoit printed on june 11 1894 so these information he gets of the past and then for tickets to a gilsburg charlie thinks of going 
Charlie thinks of going to Galesburg with wife Lucia and used to live there in her childhood days. A wonderful town with a big old houses, huge lawns and tremendous trees. Goes to a ticket counter to buy two tickets for the Galesburg. Offers the fare in the modern currency notes and then looking Clerk looks. Uh, clerk looks at him with a suspicion. Threatens to get Charlie arrested. Charlie rushes and return back. Comes back from the third level. Now Charlie consult uh, consult the psychiatrist friend that is Sam. Talks to his psychiatrist friends about the third level. Letter, not ready to accept. Letter means. the sam the psychiatrist friend he was not ready to accept that there exist any third level thinks third level only is an imaginary thinks that charlie has been daydreaming <coughs> so the fact is that he doesn't agree to it and he feels that as if he is only daydreaming charlie's second visit next day charlie buys 2 200 old dollars could never find the third level reverses attention to his stamp collection friend sam friend sam uh, friend sam vanners disappears now see this is very important point although the sam he doesn't agree that there exists a third level but still what happened child uh, charlie finds that in second level in third level he make a search because he had seen himself he make a search and suddenly he comes to know that his friend sam has been disappeared somewhere first day cover charlie an old first day cover sent to his great to his grandfather's address on july 1894 charlie opens the envelopes a letter from his friend sam charlie learns that sam has slipped into the past now surprise here that when he opens the letter he finds uh, the address was from july 1894 and he finds the letter was from sam his friend psychiatrist and charlie learns that sam has slipped into the past has reached galesburg in year 1894 urges charlie to keep trying to find that third level and sam insist um he asks the charlie to keep on finding the to keep on finding for the third level and he may come there sam's escape charlie knows sam always wanted to escape hopes that sam will be happily settle charlie reveals who sam is none other than charlie's psychiatrist friend and so sam escapes and charlie knows that he always wanted to escape and hopes that charlie will be happily settled there because galesburg was the place which charlie said was a beautiful and charlie reveals who sam is he reveals none other than charlie's psychiatrist friend and in the end he gave he tells the fact about it that sam is not other than his a psychiatrist friend earlier in two paragraph he doesn't reveal who sam is but in the last he describes it as his own friends own psychiatrist friend who doesn't have a belief on the uh, this but he, now he has escaped to this then um now this is the quick revision of the chapter and a long question that is a textual question i shall be giving you today and first is philately uh, helps keep the past alive discuss other way in which this is done what do you think of a human tendency to constantly move between the past present and the future okay this is journal question also based on this uh, the textual you have to get the example philately is uh, the hobby of collecting stamps then apparent illogical second question is apparent illogicality sometimes turns out to a futurist projection discuss with it uh, with the relation to the chapter so a uh, class um thank you very much have a good day